It was the night before Fishmas, and all through the lake, not a creature was stirring. They said F might bait. Okay, we made it somewhere. Welcome back to Batsquatch also. We are uh, prospecting some new some new potential fishy spots that we found on Google Earth, so uh, stay tuned. We'll see. Yeah. Exploring new fishing spots is always a gamble, especially this time of year. I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and call it winter. It's 30 degrees. Oh. Low water, cold water. You gotta find a really special spot to luck into some fish. Well, we got everything with us as far as um, gear and lures and we couldn't find any any worms. That was a problem we didn't really anticipate having. So, Alex got some gimmicky catfish bait. <laughs> I got some of this stuff from Buckeyes. <laughs> uh -huh. Just to try it. I'm talking to camera. Oh. I got some of this stuff. I crushed it a little bit. Hopefully it's fine. These are magic, apparently. And they're cheese flavored. But underneath, but underneath the cheese, it says blood liver cheese <laughs> mixer. So I don't know. I think they're just cheese. Shitty coffee makes a great hand warmer this time of year. Yep. All right. Well, nothing to it but to do it. I don't want to do it. <laughs> I like to throw a one thirty-second ounce. Jig head with a Bobby Garland baby shad tipped on it. Fish it low and slow. Uh, make me proud. Say make you proud. Yeah. Go cheese. Oh, that's definitely. Oh, wow. Wow, that's definitely fish. Right here in front of me. That's been a fish the whole time. Come back. Old Cody would have been so done with fishing, like, well, last month after Montauk. I know what the problem is. It ain't got no gas in it. These assholes keep flying and scaring the fish that's 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 what it is that's what it's got to be these lazy damn fish like i know they're here like i see them surface every now and again i just want to look at you <sighs> yeah i didn't get that one back well i did get it back fish. That time I bent the hook. I don't have tools to put it back. Um, let's try it out here. We'll move it around several times, I'm sure. Till we land on a fish, which could take all day. We ain't got all day. Ryder starts soccer. This, uh, in a couple hours later today. So, yeah, we don't really have a uh, plan B for today. I've got a good handful of spots that I just wouldn't mind checking. Just that uh, I've never seen, never looked at, just on Google Maps. Planes are loud. Comment below. Have you ever had any luck on that type of stuff? You know, like the the blood balls and chicken liver balls and cheese balls and, you know the dough bait the dough pre-made little catfish dough again there we go 
Ha 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 ha! Micro green sunfish. He's like three inches long. He is cute. <laughs> it's the green bastard. All right, buddy. Thanks for playing. Thanks for not making me feel like a loser. You spiky little dude. That was a little that was sketch. I'm becoming much less agile in my in my old age. Much less graceful yeah. than agile. I had to make a weird noise to yeah, get up here. I mean, uh, like a scorpion, yeah. scorpion, yeah. scorpion. We suck. <laughs> even the sunshine. Even the sun shines on a dog's ass once in a while. I'm not sure how to connect the dots other than I'm the dog's ass. And that's the sun. All right, we're back from Ryder's soccer game. He did awesome. We couldn't, um, we couldn't go home with our tail between our legs. So we're at a lake now. And we're going to let it kick our ass now. For being a poopy little creek, man, this is honestly pretty beautiful. This is a spillway where the lake dumps into this little creek, which right around the bend dumps into a larger river. So, this is a nice little hole right here. I wouldn't, I really wouldn't doubt if there'd be some crappie, spotted bass, I mean really any species. Man, this is... Oh, there we go. There we go. What are you? Stay on. You almost feel like a little catfish. Oh, it's a drum bud. Come here, buddy. Boy, he thumped it good. Come here, bud. drum. He thumped it hard. I was hoping you'd be something else. But I love you just the way you are, bud. <laughs> I'll take one drum in the hand versus none in the bush. Or however that saying goes. I was just working it really slow along the bottom and I seen that line pop. All right, once again, I was talking to myself and you guys weren't there. You missed it. Had a pretty heated debate with myself. It's disrespectful of me to come to get down here and to um, not bless the place first. This is my offering to the to the fish gods. Please accept that, holy fish spirit. To pay respect to the great and powerful and what wise Wimatanye. We call upon the sacred Wimatanya and we ask him to breathe life into our spirit bag. Let's see spirit bags Wimatanya. All right, we got the uh, trout magnet back on the jig head, and we've got a chartreuse crappie nibble tipped on it. Oh, oh there's a bite already. I can't tell if it, I think it was biting the damn. Oh, I got him. What are you? Are you a crappie? Ah, I think it was a bass. I'm almost positive that it ate my bait and then it looked up 
and then bit at the bobber. For real, something because something bit at the bobber. I think that was a little large mouth or something. Oh, oh shit! I look away and I got a fish. You might have to put a crappie bite on a bluegill. They get this gnarly purple, blue. Oh, just yeah. All right. Sorry, buddy. Go back to your cold, your cold life. Because at this point of the day, like any missed fish is like, oh shit. There we go. Any missed fish is like, I'm a failure. I shouldn't. A crappie. Ha ha. My day. Ha. Ah! Species number four and the target. Black crappie. Any crappie would have done. But look at him, man. Oh, white crappie, I'm sorry. This side is kind of irregular looking, and then you can see more stripes. This is pretty gnarly looking crappie. Thank you, friend. <laughs> see you, man. I didn't even have to put a crappie nibble on it that time. He took the main course without needing the appetizer, you know what I'm saying? Appetizer. Is that what I said? Apper. Well, between the the one crappie that I caught and the whiskey, I'm feeling warmer. Survey says the fish are hoes. That is correct. There's some hoes in this creek. There's some hoes in this creek. Oh, there we go. What are you? A crappie! He's about the same size. Dude, that's funny. These crappies stink too. Maybe it's something about... Maybe it's something that's just normal. I don't know. Do crappies start stinking during the, during the fall? Or are we just catching them out of stinky places? Give it a little wiggle, 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 wiggle. Alright, the MacGyver in me is wearing off on Lady Basquatch. So what did you do there, Alice? I tied foam from my nightcrawler box. Something. Took a piece of foam off the nightcrawler box. They're biting it so subtly. There you go. Bluegill? A little gilly bud. That's all it is. Oh, Mr. Gilly. I know what you're wondering right now. Did I cast five times or six? You feel lucky? Well, do you, punk? Ultralight spinning rod. The most weakest pole in the world. Bluegill? Yep. They're so small. I know. Another gill? Damn. Yep. There we go. Gill. <gasps> I'm gonna teach you a lesson your da your daddy should have. Yeah, come here, you little shit. What are you? You're a bluegill. It's not polite to play with people's emotions. Do you have it or not? Fish. There we go. There we go. Hey, it's a bass. A largemouth. Is that six species? Or five? A largemouth bass. A little crappie, aren't you? Yeah. Just as close to that brush as you can. Oh no. See what you've done?
Here you go, buddy. You're a flounder. Well, hey, Mr. Han. So long, beautiful, cold November. Concrete spillway that gave us a little bit of life today. We'll see you again. We caught something. <laughs> it took me all day. And, uh, checked out a few new spots and, and I mean, what else can you ask for in fall when it was 30 degrees this morning? We're happy just to catch anything and just be out. Right. <laughs> so, um, make sure you guys leave a thumbs up, subscribe. It re we'd really appreciate it if you subscribe. If you're not already, if you're not already, ask yourself why you're not. Stay wild. Stay wild, guys. <laughs> Bye, you have a lovely park. A bluegill. I'm Johnny Knoxville. Welcome to Jackass. But I love you just the way you are, bud. Appetizer. And her cheese flavored. Oh, uh, no. Blood balls and chicken liver balls. <laughs> Keeping your expectations down. I've never wanted to catch a bluegill so bad. To the fish. It's not as big as it looked from back there. Haha! Than I'm the dog's ass. I crushed it a little bit. Hopefully it's fine. <laughs> we matanye. Yeah, standing on the rooftop. So I really don't wanna. It went. I just wanna look at ya. Yeah, here, fishy, fishy. To play with people's emotions. Yeah, I'm talking like two or three inches of worm at the most. I'm a sucker for some pan fish. Oh, that's definitely. Oh, wow. Good deal, Lucille. And thanks for not making me feel like a loser. Yeah, we don't really have a uh, plan B for today. Oh, I got my wish. I got my worms.